No, no, Jenny said she left over an hour ago. Maybe she went to the grocery store. <laughs> Come on, Felicia. Tiffany has not been in a grocery store since her mother stopped wheeling around on a shopping cart. Well, you told her to keep an eye on Ashton, right? In case he took off with a dragon ball. Yeah. And maybe he did, and she followed him. Oh, no, no, no. Well, why hasn't she contacted us then? No, no, I, you know, I am sorry I ever got her involved in this in the first place, but she kept, she kept on yammering about never letting her in on anything. Well, she probably have a good explanation. I'm sure we'll hear from her. You know what I don't get is why we hadn't heard from Van Buren yet. Probably because he's not the big fish that we think he is. Why else would he be monitoring what's going on down in the Aphrodite from his plane? Well, if he would have heard that you were leaving the dragon bone and the emerald here, he would have made his move by now, wouldn't he? Well, maybe he didn't get the message yet. One more hour, then I'm looking for Tiffany. So wherever she is, I'm sure she's fine. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on, lady. Help me with that. Hold on a second. I've got it. I've got it. Hold on. Oh, sit down. Stop screaming. We're going to slap you. You almost broke my arm. Oh, it is the only way we can keep you quiet. Just tie her tight, will you? Tie me tight. You're going to think tie me tight. This will be just right. Ow. Ow. Woman is a certified lunatic. Never laid eyes on me. The boss is going to kill us. Taking hostages was not part of the plan. She ran in on us. What are we supposed to do? What? She's loaded with expensive jewelry. Forget it. No, I mean, she's got to be somebody. She was at that date, no, Felicia. Maybe she knows something about the items we're supposed to take. I don't care if I don't get out of here right now. Just don't say anything about it. Right? Let's find out who she is. I'm not listening to this. We want to ask you a few questions. So you better answer for your own sake. Oh, right? for my own sake, young woman. Who are you? <laughs> Who am I? I am Tiffany Hill. Did you ever see my movies? I'm on a TV session. Oh. My husband is Sean Donnelly. I happen to be a very close friend of the Jagger, will you? Oh, you sound much Dad. better that way, lady. I get very sick when I'm dying. I don't know. Oh, you look like a movie star. Friday, listen to me. I want you to get this right this time. Okay, calm down. Lay down. See, this dog does everything backwards. <laughs> now sit up. Oh, oh my no. gosh, I can't believe he does everything backwards. He's very contrary, like his father. <laughs> good, what? good boy. Why are you being so quiet? He's mad because Catherine's going to Los Angeles with Paul. Who is this kid? Let him throw her out. If you ask me, I think he's kind of yucky with Hey, Mr. Duvall is always very nice to you. I know, but that's just because I'm Catherine's friend. But I think he's pretending. Yeah, well, I think he's pretending about a lot of things. Can I call Catherine to say goodbye? Sure. Okay. This kid's okay. We'll keep her for a few days. Your relationship has such longevity. Yeah. I really like that about you. Yeah, I'm a sweetheart. <laughs> yeah. That's the magic mushroom. <laughs> Hello? Captain, hi, it's me, Robin. Hi, Robin. Hi. I just wanted to say goodbye, because I'm going to miss you a lot. Yeah, I'm going to miss you, too. When are you going to be coming back? Well, I I'm not sure. Captain! <laughs> Captain! What's wrong? Are you still on the phone? What's happening? I don't know. We were just talking, then I heard someone scream. Catherine? Catherine! Catherine! I don't know, the line went dead or something went wrong at the other end. What did she say? Nothing, we were just talking and I heard someone scream. She screamed? I don't know if it was Catherine, but Daddy, I'm scared. I'm heading over there. Okay, we're gonna come with you, come on. Yes. Freddy, come back here! He'll come back when he's hungry. What happened? What did you... She fell down. Oh, you yeah, fell out of my... What happened? I fell down the stairs. It's oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, Mama. The blood's going to be over to the sofa. Okay. Oh, you oh. oh. no. I, I don't think I can move. You can't move. No. Don't move. Don't move. Uh, where does it hurt? Oh, you know it hurts everywhere. I think it's broken. Oh, God. It's broken. It's broken. I should have paid more attention in first aid custody. Ambulance. All right. I'll call an ambulance. Oh, good thinking. Don't move. Oh, no, I couldn't move. move if I tried. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, Paul, there, all set to go to the... No, Mar Mary's just fell down the stairs. She's what? Yes, we're going to call an ambulance. We have to take her to the hospital right away. What happened, Mary? 
Oh, well, I was going, going down the stairs with Maura Catherine's luggage, and, and, and my heel caught in the busted carpeting. I, I tried to grab for the banister, but I just went flying. Did you hit your head or what? No, no, just my leg. I think it's broken. Let me see. Okay. Ah! Oh, don't, no, don't touch it. That hurts too much. Oh, good. I'll get you some brandy. I think it's going to be all right. It doesn't appear to be broken. Oh, Mary. it's broke. I just know it is. I know it is. You just stay there, okay? Catherine, where did I miss our flight to Los Angeles? Oh, how can you even think about that now? I can't leave Mary like this. Oh, thanks, darling. No, thanks. Hello? Uh, no, we don't want a subscription to the Port Charles event. Thanks. Oh. All of this waiting has made me kind of hungry. Um, I happen to know that Bobby has some cold cuts down in her refrigerator. Do any of you want a sandwich? Yeah, sure, I would like one. Thanks. Huh? No. I'll be right back. So, Sean, do you think Angera is going to make his move tonight for the Dragon Ball? Not him personally, no. Well, you know what I mean. He thinks it's here. But the only thing I am sure of right now is the man has bugged the Aphrodite, okay? Okay, well, I mean, he's got to be the man that WSB is looking for, don't Maybe. you think? Maybe. Well, why else would he care what's going on on the Aphrodite? Oh, come on. Ashton has all people, all kinds of people involved in his quest, right? Well, maybe Van Buren is the, the silent one. How the hell would I know? He didn't bat an eyelash at the airport when you told him that we had a meeting with him. Look, the man has poker face down to a science. Okay. Now, if he has caught our story about taking off at the dragon bone and the map, then we should have had some kind of reaction by now. Well, I'm sure he'll hear about it sometime soon. Oh, we'll wait a little while longer, okay? A little while longer. One thing is for sure, I'm not leaving Felicia here alone until I know no, I still going can't on. figure out why I haven't heard from Tiffany. It's bugging me. Are you sure she got your instructions right? I, I told her to stay at the Quartermains until Ashton got back. Now, if I'm right, he probably had the dragon bone and the emerald on his briefcase when he left the Aphrodite. Right? Well, he's got to be home by now. Then why hasn't she signaled us with that device I gave her? Maybe it's broken. Why, why don't you try home? Yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe you're right, maybe you're right. Maybe she's, uh, <laughs> maybe she's just lolling around in a, a bathtub full of bubbles. Yeah, I'm sure that's Are you out of your mind? You heard what the boss says. No one gets hurt. She's making me crazy. Okay? No one, no one gets hurt. I'll call the boss. Maybe he'll know what to do about this. Yes. It's Kirk. Did you get the items I asked for? We have a little problem, sir. You didn't get them. This woman walked in on us at the house just when we were putting our masks on. We had to grab her, otherwise she would have called the cops. Where are you? We're at the hideout. Who is she? She says she's Sean Donnelly's wife. What? Donnelly's wife? Look, boss. If you want. No, no, you just stay right there. Don't move and don't do a thing until you hear from me and don't harm a hair on her head. Did they get the dragon bone in the emerald? Those idiots accidentally kidnapped Sean Donnelly's wife. Can you believe that? What? Tiffany? If Sean Donnelly finds out she's relax, been kidnapped... Relax, just relax, she's... all right? Perhaps, maybe... Maybe some good can come out of their stupidity. I'm sure he would happily trade his wife for the dragon bone. <sighs> oh. Who knows, Ariel? Used properly, love does conquer all.
the old dragon bone safe till we sail?